Hey, I'm Skylar. Your iPhone actually gives you quite a lot of control when it comes to notifications and how you manage them. So let's take a quick look at the Notification Center and see how we can uh, customize it. So I'm going to press my home button and slide to unlock and tap settings. Right here, grouped with Do Not Disturb is Notifications. Tap Notifications and let's see. Let's start with messages, because if I don't want to receive alerts, this is a pretty good place to start. Now, up at the top, it says Notification Center. What does that mean? This is Notification Center. To access it, I just pull down from the top of the screen. So this shows me the weather today, allows me to quickly tap to tweet, so as we miss phone calls, reminders, calendar events, etc. Stock ticker too. If I don't want my text messages to show up there, I just tap no, off, not a notification center. If I do have them showing up there, I can also ask it to only show me the most recent text or the 10 most recent texts or the five. Down here, I can determine the alert style. So I can either have no alert I can have banners, those roll down from the top, so they don't interrupt what I'm doing. And I can just tap on them in order to actually see the thing that was sent to me. Or I can tap alerts. The difference between these things is that banners go away on their own. Alerts require an action from you. So if you have, say, a business email account and a personal email account, you might set up your personal email account as um, banners and then your work email account as alerts. So the banners pop up and go away. The work email comes up as an alert and so you either have to tap read or tap dismiss. Just another way of getting yourself to pay attention to the important things. You can also turn off the badge app icons which are these red things here. You can change the tone associated with any particular notification. You can have it show a preview or not. You can have it repeat the alert. And you can show iMessage alerts from everyone or only contact. So that way if unfamiliar spam robots are targeting me, I can say, no, I don't want to see those alerts. I can also tell it to show those things to me in the lock screen or not. So we've gone over all the different customization options for the Notification Center for messages specifically. But what you'll see is that many other applications can be added to the Notification Center and can themselves be customized. So now that I've shown you where it is, have fun exploring. Tailor it the way you want it. I'm Skylar. Thanks for watching.